So today we're going to be doing what's in our backpack and this is going to be high school versus middle school because I am in 11th grade. I'm in 6th. <laughs> so she's actually going to middle school so it's a pretty big deal and for me it also is big because junior is supposedly your hardest year. So Elliot will start us off with her book bag and show us what's in it. Okay. Um. So first thing I got is water bottle. Did you know Blue. it matches your book bag? I didn't know that at first <laughs> when I ordered the backpack, oh. but... Then I got... Oh yeah. Front, I got face mask and more face mask. Then I got eraser tap... Top eraser thingy. tap toppers? Top toppers <laughs> toppers. <laughs> And um, then I got two bottles of hand sanitizer. Very essential for school this year. Is that it in your front yeah. pouch? Then I got... My pencil case. You know what it looks like? It looks like a giant pencil. Yeah. <laughs> I think it does. And then... All my stuff is in wow, it. Wow, so organized. I have three normal pencils, um, highlighters, um, colored pencils, four mechanical pencils, and then pens. Red, blue, and black, I think. Then I got three things of paper. Then I got journals. I got black, orange, black, pink. So many. Blue and purple. Then I got folders. Purple, gray, white, orange, gray, and pink. So that's all that's in my backpack. And obviously everything will change once she starts school because every class you need something different. But anyways, so that was Ellie's sixth grade book bag and now I'm moving on to my 11th grade book bag. So this year I just chose a simple Jansport and both of our book bags came from Tilly's. We ordered them online if you guys watched that video. Um, my book bag is different from Ellie's. I have three pockets and she only has two but it's kind of the same thing anyway so this small little one right here is like more for me i guess um i have an extra face mask i have chapstick then i have gum because why not that's my gum well you gave it to me <laughs> Then I do have hand sanitizer. I do have another bottle, but I'll put that one in later on when it runs out. And then I have perfume, super tiny, a twist cap one. And then I do have feminine products in there as well. Feminine? Fem feminine? Feminine? I don't know how you say it. Fem feminine? 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 Fem <laughs> what feminine? same thing whatever i have those in there so moving on into the next pocket um this one's a lot bigger but all i keep in here is my index cards and then my art pouch there's actually like little i don't know if you guys can see that it has like little storage compartments for your pens and pencils but i find this a lot easier so inside i have my scissors we have lots of pens, pencils, dry erase markers, highlighters, and yeah, so that's everything in there. Nothing too fancy, but I just keep this in that pouch because I like to keep everything separated. 
pretty organized, you know? You feel me? Oh. One second. This is really hard to zip up. <laughs> okay. Then, moving on to the bigger portion of my book bag. Ugh. I honestly don't have a lot because... For high school, when we go in the first day, each teacher assigns like a list of everything you actually need for the class. So basically, I just put all my basics, like notebooks and stuff, but anyways, I'll go through it. So I do have three notebooks. Technically, I only re need, technically, I only need one for the first day of school, but I have my squiggly one, and I have this one, and then that one, and then F Last year, I only used one folder for literally every class, but I probably will change that because I'll probably want to be more organized, but I only have one folder, which is white. Then I do have two binders, but this one is filled with paper. I use paper a lot, so. You almost had me with that. <laughs> so I have a white one. Ow. And then I also, and last but not least, have a gray one, and there's nothing in this one. But I really don't need binders on the first day, but it's nice to have if you want to put, like, papers in it or something. Um, I'll, probably, I'll probably put more, like, when it gets closer to the first day, but this is all that I really need until, like, the second week of school. So, yeah, I really like my book bag. I like the color. It's probably going to get really dirty because it is like a white color, but it is cream. Cream. And then there's the back. The bottom's brown, which I'll like because it's not white, so it won't get dirty because I put my book bag on the ground all the time. So those are our book bags and what's in our book bag for 2020. I am excited for this school year. Um, I actually just got my parking pass today and I am very close to the school and I also am parked in a whole line of friends. <laughs> so like the first person in my friend group starts at 32 and it goes all the way to 38 and I'm 38. So yeah, I'm so excited for the school year. I think it's going to be a lot different. What are you excited about? I don't know. Going to middle school? Really? I don't know. It's gonna be weird because you actually get to change classes and you didn't do that I did last it in third grade. Well, like two, right? Or did you do all of them? Two. Oh, this is different. Like you switch every every class. But for science, we would go to a different place and mm -hmm. then language. Our so yeah, grade. middle school is very different. So I'll prepare her, don't worry. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and you enjoy it if you're excited to go back to school or if you're doing online. Also, to let you guys know, we are going back to school, like regular school. That's why we have masks and stuff. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and we'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, Bye. guys.